What's up everyone, for the win, Itachi here, BlizzCon 2018 Day 2 is here, and I'm basically giving you guys some information that was not announced during the cinematics, not announced during the trailers, and this is basically the side information and the key information and actually doing things in the game, such as for Overwatch and Heroes of the Storm, I'll give you guys some information on the heroes that were announced, or the content that was announced, World of Warcraft, I'll be giving you some information on the upcoming uh, events that are going to be occurring in the game, um, for example, how to get Diablo Immortal. Don't dislike the video because I've already said that. And then next, uh, for this one, we're going to be going over Warcraft 3, Reforge, and how much does it cost and what the hell is that Spoils of War edition all about? So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this goddamn thing, fam. Alright, so we got Warcraft 3, Reforge. Uh, pretty much, uh, you can get the $29.99 Standard Edition, or you can get the Spoils of War edition for $39.99. Or, you can lose a lot of money. And spend 80 bucks, 79.99 on the spoils of war plus the virtual ticket when BlizzCon's already over, fam. It's already over. And you probably can watch the shit anywhere else. I got the BlizzCon ticket for free. Yeet. But anyways, um, yeah, you can either get the spoils of war for 40 or the standard edition for $30. And that's for World of Warcraft, uh, for World of Warcraft. That's for Warcraft 3 Reforged. And, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and check out what that goddamn spoils of war is all about. So... First up, you get cool in-game items for tons of blizzardy games. For example, they've already got the Hearthstone back, fam. They've already got the Hearthstone. Why is it always Hearthstone back? Why can't we get a cool card? Like, I don't know. Just give me a cool legendary golden card. Just give me something cool. I'm sick of the card backs, fam. It actually looks pretty cool, though. I'm not going to lie. That fits the theme very well. With the three in the background, Warcrafty looking. I got that. Next up. Probably the coolest item of the thing, because it is a Warcraft game. World of Warcraft's gonna get the coolest item. You get the meat mount. This thing is a catapulting working mount that ch chugs meat everywhere. Damn straight. Does it got eyes? Like, it looks like it has eyes and horns and everything. I don't even know. I'm done with this. And then... There's also gonna be some in-game items for Warcraft 3, Diablo, Starcraft, and Starcraft 2. That have just yet to be announced, so stay tuned for that. And we also, last but not least, have some cool hero skins coming to Heroes of the Storm that you will be given with the uh, Spoils of War as well. But that's all that's announced right now, so I mean, you can hold off on your purchase, but do expect some um, in-game items for Warcraft 3, of course, Diablo 3, Starcraft, and Starcraft 2, and maybe some more. They really don't have everything out and announced yet, but... Spoilers of War, you're pretty much getting in some in-game items for some uh, other Blizzard Entertainment games. But other than that, love you all. Thank you very much for tuning in. Leave a like on the video. Check out the description box and subscribe.